The Crater Diamond State Park used to do an excavation project every fall for years, but hadn't done any for a while. The money was appropriated for other things. But last fall, they dug a trench here at the south end. This is where the old diamond recovery plant used to sit here. It was five stories tall. You can't even tell anything used to be here a hundred years ago. It's all woods now, but they dug this ditch to divert water from the south end on over to the east drain. And I think it's going to be interesting to surface search through here. Yeah, a little water is collected because of the way the silt piled up in here. But if we walk right along this, the slope on each side has never been exposed, you know, in, in years or ever because this cut was just made through here. So this really hasn't been surface searched much. And it sure hadn't been surface searched after it sat for two months and subjected to a lot of rain. So I just kind of want to look at this gravel. There's really a lot of good gravel here. Now, this part of the field hasn't been plowed for a while because you, you can tell because for one thing it's flat and the other thing it's grown up with grass quite a bit. But there's a good gravel all along here. A lot of possibilities. A, any one of these rocks could be a diamond sitting here. So I'm you're surface searching with me this morning. Oh, a deer went through. This is a deer track, and it got a little bit stuck in the mud here in the middle, but it was trying to cross, you know, maybe last night or something. And uh, I'll testify the only tracks I've seen on this field so far this morning are deer tracks. So the maintenance crew has not been in here, uh, park employees have not been in surface searching for the last two months while, while the park was closed and nobody else could search. Uh, they just aren't that way. They just didn't do it. They left it for, for us to search. Looks like somebody's been digging here. We got a pick, some other tools. There's a little ditch that came down through here. But I like I like the looks of this gravel. There could be a diamond in this material. So you're surface searching with me. This is the first time anybody's ever looked through this for the last two months. The rest of the crowd is over there closer to the entrance. And here we are at the south end, kind of by ourselves looking at this gravel for the first time and uh, the sun is beginning to come out we've had good overcast morning but it's beginning to burn through the clouds and it is getting hotter and more humid but that sun should help us spot the diamonds that's here so if you see something glisten you might want to come back and get it if i miss it uh, we're right here near the john huddleston sign where the first diamonds were found in 1906, August of 06. So for reference point, here's the shovel marker. In this picture, John Huddleston is pointing to this spot. They had a stake put here way back showing that the first diamond was found here. Now the sun's coming out on this field of gravel, field of diamond potential. Some ditches that have washed down through here and I see a layer of black as well in among this green and rocks collecting as they wash on down to the new newly dug ditch here. But to me this would be a hot spot to look. I'm going to shut the camera off and study this a lot closer. <clears throat> I want to bring you over to one historic spot here. 
I believe, where the water tower used to sit in the old hundred-year-old photos. I believe this is the water pipe, the standpipe for the water tower. And so it used to sit right here. And so for reference, in the old pictures, the diamond plant sat over there and the water tower was off to this side. So uh, Eric Young from Eureka Springs is surface searching down there. He knows this is a good spot to look because he's found a lot of diamonds here. So, But uh, we don't have many people searching this area, yet it looks really primed to find a diamond. So I'm going to shut the camera off and try to find one and then I'll turn the camera on and show you that diamond I just found.